Temporary strainer must be removed following system cleanup, max 24 hours. It's also written in yellow here. So yeah. what we're gonna do is we're gonna open this up. We're gonna, we've already loosened these. We're gonna open this up and look at what's inside and talking about how to remove that construction strainer or startup strainer is what you would call it, Joe? Exactly, we call it a uh, startup strainer. It's a fine mesh strainer. Take a look, you can see this is a fine mesh meant to capture some of those smaller pieces of debris. Of course, being a fine mesh, it means that it'll get clogged quite easily. Yeah. So it's not meant to stay there permanently. We want you to remove it after you flush the system. So basically we have two strainers. We have a fine mesh on the outer side and then inside it's more of a coarse mesh strainer. Yeah, exactly. So after 24 hours, it seems like this is tacked onto this. So we need to remove the fine mesh strainer. So what do we do? Just cut it away or pry it away from that yeah. that coarse mesh? A screwdriver and a, and a pair of side cutters. It's just tack welded on. All right, so once this fine mesh has been removed, basically we're gonna take what's left and then we're gonna put it back in and that's gonna protect the suction guide and the pump going forward, right? Exactly. 